DJ Carton pushing ahead. That pass picked off by Cave York. Not only has Gort York been one of the top scorers in the league, among the league leaders in steals, too. And turning off, turning defense into quick offense, being able to score in transition. We talk about all the time about how they uh, score the fastest in the league as guards are there with the. Lawson, second effort. How high did he jump right there? This is about how fast he's able to get to that second jump. York, blow by, contact, puts it in. Stockton, skip pass, Servinus, yeah. Six for the Ants. Great ball movement there, cross court pass. And again, we talk about David Eyes, how well he's able to shoot as Lewis makes a three. And that was a heat check. Pull up three, Lawson, no. Garza, the offensive rebound, and he scores. What a sequence there. Up tempo, Garza wants three. Give him three. Garza last year played in 32 games for the Pistons, starting five. This year, one appearance so far with Minnesota. Couple of turnovers in a row for Fort Wayne. Dozier, the NBA vet, ties it up. Allowing everybody to get a piece of the action. Garza with the interception, and he takes it all the way. Third three. Another turnover committed by the Mad Ants. Curtain around the rim and in. Okay, position here at home, but Mad Ants have a little extra urgency to win here tonight. Gabe York flying through the air to lay it in for the Ants here in the Showcase Cup. It's another steal for York. Behind the back, the pass to Bradshaw. That rattles in. Sort of wonder what he's still doing here, but he is committed to working his way back. And he's doing things the right way. Like it's not just, as David has, uh, he's being a great team guy, not being a ball hog. Sometimes you see guys who can score the basketball. When they get it, they kind of take the life out of your team. Who will be in the top eight of the 30 in the G that'll get to play for some extra cash? Two for Anderson, the lead four for Fort Wayne. But cash will be on the line just ahead of Christmas in Las Vegas. Ellaby, he's got two threes off the bench in the last few minutes. Big time shot there by Ellaby, just letting it fly. And an answer, Pedro Bradshaw. Uh, me having a, a young son now, I truly uh, can imagine how much pride Mr. Garza has in watching his son. Jermaine Samuels fakes it in. Well, as the first quarter ended, there was a question as to whether or not the Wolves made a buzzer beater. It was deemed to be after the clock expired. Kevin Brown off to Norvell Pell. Yeah, he earned his first. 15 seconds into the game. Managed to avoid another after that. Brown fires and connects on the assist from Justin Anderson. That was the ninth turnover committed by the Mad Ants. Cook, fade away. Fort Wayne a half game ahead of Iowa and the central standings here in the Showcase Cup. Eli Brooks, catch and shoot. He's a bucket. Fadeaway bucket. Yeah, he identified a mismatch and the NBA vet took advantage. Tevin Brown around the screen. He hits second three for the rookie out of Murray. Well, just as the ants started to create some separation, Brooks shot fake drive. 
Finds Brown in the corner. Oh, the rookie is hot. practice that baseline drive, baseline drift all the time, and there yeah, those guys ran into perfection. Extra pass, Bradshaw, book it! Hockey assist for Anderson. But again, that was an example where Justin could have shot the three, he could have shot the pull up, he passed the ball to Brown, Brown could have shot it, but made that extra pass. I guess I will have to see that again to see where Sampson was, but... Runner good, Javante Cook. Doing all the little things, and uh, to be able to have a guy like Gabe who can just do everything on the floor and score with ease, just to try to just to kind of understand the basketball game on the offensive side. It's a lot to 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 be able to put yourself in those positions to understand what you need to work on, uh, to be ready to do things like that, knock down threes. York for Samuels. Monster jam. Three assists now for York to go with his 11 points. My goodness. Of the loud variety. York, little space. He's a torch. Timeout, Iowa. Yes, we get a steal right here. Uh, just great to see. Samuels to Stockton, whose layup was swatted by A.J. Lawson. And one. A prize of $100,000 to be distributed among players. And while some of these guys striving for every dollar at this point, for others, that's significant money. For sure. And if there's money to be won, why not go get it? They're giving it out. Let's go get it. Letting the game come to him. He's got 17. Meanwhile, it's the third triple tonight for Ellaby. Dozier. Yeah. Rebound York. Anderson running the floor. The finger roll. LB on the attack. Sticks with it. And Garza on the third chance. Here's an offensive rebound for Norvell Pell. Unkind. Garza out for Dozier. Servetus gets to his spot, but he misses. It's a track meet, and Garza throws it down. I started getting into soccer late, like I'm talking about, like last couple months. Free throw good for Garza, he has 28. Teardrop for York, that falls. And on the other end for us, man, Gabe, they're showing some finesse with the floater. Numbers for the Ants. Anderson hesitated and attacks. Rare miss for Garza, saved on the baseline by York. Stockton to York. Big time finish, and that's an equalizer. You can tell both these teams are settling in. Uh, there again, Luca. It's going to take a with this madass lineup. It's going to take a group effort to keep Luca off the boards. And so right now, Jermaine Samuels is an undersized five. Fort Wayne feels like Samuels is really strong. He's, he's got the strength to be a five, but the, the little faces on the kids as they got the. The different toys they wanted, man, it was just an amazing event. Layup for Gabe York, but cause for concern right now. Nice take. 
two competitors going at it. Anderson from behind knocked it away. Running, Eli Brooks. Bang! Um, shows the, the unbelievable heart. Jermaine Samuels off a trampoline, puts it down and ties it up. Um, on our staff here, but uh, it's cool when they want to, when they want to, they love it so much they want to wear it again. In the corner, Tevin Brown, go ahead three. And much needed, especially considering how Pedro Bradshaw went down earlier in this quarter. It's good to see we can report that Pedro is actually back. Fourth quarter underway. Has a tough break for the Mad Ants. Nice response, though, as York assists to Jermaine Samuels. I, I think you, leave, you keep that challenge. This, this is going to be a, 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 a tough game. You want to make sure you have it. Servetus. Their final home game in the Showcase Cup. The floater falls for Eli Brooks. That's a big time floater by Eli. That's not an easy shot. Ellaby, sniper. again you know at, at times if your coach kind of earned a team like that I mean would that kind of fire you up help you refocus maybe yeah, no no doubt about it you can tell that it, this means something to your coach had a look to tie that game in the closing seconds and even though he's hit a game tying and game winning three this year not on that night that three is good Luca Garza season high 36 Bullseye for the former Iowa Hawkeye. Servetus to Brooks. Back to Servetus. Splash! That's just beautiful basketball. It's that two-man game. Those two guys working together, both great shooters. Iowa knows they got to jump out on both of those guys. And just way to play. Samuels hungry for the ball. Brooks up ahead. Showtime! Gabe York! Timeout, Iowa! Bad ass doing a great job of capitalizing and continuing, as you see with this defensive intensity to fly around. P.J. Tozier, there's a steady presence. Harton on the drive. Corner three, pure. Lawson, no good. On the layup. York up ahead. Brown. Tevin Brown. Big factor. Yeah, that's probably what's holding him back from really being a mainstay in the NBA, but. Dozier, one point game. David Servetus. It adds up. Lewis, no. Garza gobbles it up, puts it in. 40 points for Luca Garza. He's a force. Both sides have turned it over 23 times. Dozier and one. He's got a chance to tie it up. There by Dozier to draw the foul, wait to hear the whistle, and then. Samuels, big finish. David hitting him right where he needed the basketball. Four assists for Stockton, nearly a steal. Instead, Garza going off. And that's a great defensive play by Luca there to be able to follow Gabe and get a block shot and get possession, which led to a big three there by A.J. Lawson. Garza and Lawson, the Mad Ants don't. Only nine available tonight. That's an equalizer, Justin Anderson. 
Those are his shots. And then the turnover bug hits the Wolves again. Stockton puts it in. Now the presence to run some clock. Samuels got an angle on Garza who recovers with the block. Garza. No. Bradshaw boards it. Coming down to the final minute. No look feed. Stockton to Bradshaw. And a rebound for TJ Carton. Two point game. Samuels called for the blocking foul. Big Monday night matchup. Iowa and Fort Wayne. And a battle for first in the Central in this Showcase Cup. Gabe York, rise and fire, and he buries it. Timeout, Wolves. One away from matching a franchise record for threes in a game. That was their 20. That changed last year. Now he wants to go back, as hungry as ever. Lawson, corner three. High off. Luca Garza has a G League career high, 42 points in this game. It's Lewis, no, stocked in the rebound. And the father of four knocks down the first. Iowa has made 16 threes tonight. Easy two for Garza, that was a nice pass. More than anyone in franchise history. Lead back to five with six and a half seconds. 